good day to you all, and these are your daily news. We are three days away from the closing of the 68th Dubrovnik Summer Festival, and as us locals here say, once the festival flag is lowered, this marks the beginning of the end of all the bustle and hustle throughout our beautiful city. But we still have a few more days left to enjoy all the action. With that said, the 68th Dubrovnik Summer Festival this evening presents the exhibition opening, A Sculpture Time by Alyosha Reboy. This exhibition reflects Tomasz Pandur's theater opus in Croatia. Pandur was one of the most relevant contemporary theater directors who left an indelible mark on the Croatian theater scene through his work and cooperation with the Croatian National Theater and Dubrovnik Summer Festival. The exhibition will be available for viewing until September 1st, every day from 6 p.m. to 10 p.m. at the Sponza Palace Atrium, and entrance is free of charge. We continue with the 68th Dubrovnik Summer Festival and the third performance of Marin Držić's Victory Over the Enemies. This year marks the 450th anniversary of the death of Marin Držić, and in this play, Držić speaks of himself, of his and our time, as well as the world we live in, which has deteriorated over the times. The play will begin this evening at 9.30 p.m. at the Art School Park, and ticket prices are 175 kunas to 300 kunas per person. You can purchase your tickets online at Dubrovnik-Festival.hr, at the Festival Palace box office, or at the venue one hour prior to the performance. If you're staying at Hotel Radisson Sun Garden, or if you're just going to make your way over to the charming city of Orashats this evening, the hotel has prepared a real treat for everyone, with Croatia's most welcomed performer, Tonči Hulic and the Madre Badesha Band. <laughs> Inspired by the sounds, emotions, and lifestyle of the Mediterranean, discover this truly peculiar musical blend performed by Tonči Hulic and the Madre Badesha Band. Join them for an unforgettable summer evening and explore the best Mediterranean sounds performed live in the stunning setting of the Oregano Terrace. Please note that the entrance is with a pre-booking only. For more information and reservations, please contact the Radisson Concierge. We have now gotten to the end of our program for today, and here is your weather forecast for the next couple of days. Dubrovnik this morning was a little bit chilly, with our morning low reaching up to 23 degrees Celsius and our daily high reaching up to 29 degrees Celsius. Tomorrow, another cooler day awaits us, thanks to our northern wind, Buda, being present in the last couple of days. Our morning lows tomorrow will reach up to 20 degrees Celsius, with our daily high reaching up to 29 degrees Celsius. On Thursday, sunny skies will prevail, but still cooler temperatures, with our mornings being up to 19 degrees Celsius and our daily high reaching up to 27 degrees Celsius. Friday to Monday, sunny skies will warm all of us up, but lower temperatures are still present. We can expect our lows to range from 19 to 22 degrees Celsius, with our daily highs reaching from 28 to 29 degrees Celsius. It will definitely be less windy, but still comfortable. Sea temperatures are quite low, reading 21.4 degrees this morning. Thank you so much for tuning in today. I'll be with you again tomorrow. Until then, have a wonderful day.